Yo, what it do? It's your girl, Julissa the Realist, and uh, we have a brand new day. Today is a really good day for me. I'm feeling super high energy and all of that, and I'm going outside today, guys. Outside, outside, everybody outside, we're going outside. No, for real, I'm actually going outside today, and it's going to be a good one because I feel like I spend the majority of my time indoors and you know you know the drill anyways so today we are going to pick up some things one of those things includes getting some organic like vegetables and good things for my belly i feel like i've definitely been eating really bad i've been eating real bad so i want to make sure that i fill my body with some like you know nourishing things of course and that means going to the organic market today so we're, we're going to the market we're gonna get some things i ordered some holy good stuff i'll just show you later what i ordered and uh what else we're gonna do we're gonna sit by the beach a little bit today i just feel like when i'm out there with the water it just really really grounds me it reminds me of the fact that there's just so much world happening beyond what we can actually see and uh, that everything I'm seeing although it's so grand for me is really just a speck of like you know what's available for us so that'll be fun I'm gonna meet up with my girl Jamila so you'll see Jamila today and yeah let's go See, I don't ever be showing Bay, but this is what he does. Whenever he's not on camera or we're not out, this is what he's doing, ironing shirts. He just irons them even if he's not gonna wear them. He'll just iron them. Coconut time. Thank you. So today at the beach, all of these people are working their very hardest to try to pull in this a net of fish. These people have been pulling for what seems like hours. And every time they pull, the water pulls back. It seems like everybody from the community has come out to play their part. Let's see how much fish even comes out of here. Alright, we're not saying nothing, so I have to come and get a closer look. So see in the net, the net has these tiny, tiny silver fish. This is what they're pulling. Do you see them? They're so small. Wow. I'm not yeah. here for the traffic. I'm not yeah. here for the waste of money. 
you get what I mean? Yeah. But I know the thing that's happening in January, the free concert in January. Yeah, like I Black would... Line, the Black Line, the Chance of Rapture is big, right? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I would do it because I think I can't remember who's gonna be there. Erica Badu is gonna be there. Yeah, I heard remember that. Remember that time when we went to go see her Erica DJ? Erica Badu. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Right. <laughs> Oh, that was really good, but yeah, that is a good one actually. Mm -hmm. I tried to get tickets. Did you? No, I so, don't even know how to get tickets. These days. So, Chance After had posted, like, okay, click on the website to get some tickets. I clicked, and the, the something said, um, sold out for the week. So, they're only selling week by week. Oh, well, I guess. Well, they're not even selling, they're just free, they're free tickets, but I guess they're like they're they're releasing them so out. Okay, yeah. So, I put myself on the email. Thingy so that they can notify me when there's more tickets because I'd like to see that too. Yeah. I think for Afro Cello though, like, I mean, I've seen Brenna Boy already, but it's Brenna Boy concert is fun. Like, Brenna, it's a, it's a, a vibe. Performer. Yeah, it's a vibe. I really just want to go for the vibe of it, you know? Just to say that I went, I went to Afro Cello basically. But I do get like, I've heard so much bad stuff about the traffic. Like, I, my girl Zakisha was telling me that one year it was so bad that they got stuck in the traffic on the highway and they came out of the car on the highway and just walked the rest of the way. Like, it was that bad. So, and then, and then, like, unfortunately, especially with inflation. There are pickpocketers, people will take your phone. Like, I just don't want it. I, I want to be able to be free. I just don't want to deal with yeah. all of that. But we'll see, you know? If, yeah. I guess. We'll see, we'll see. We'll see. Yeah. Well, let's see December. <laughs> Who knows? I know. <laughs> Who knows? But for now, we're just out here enjoying it, the sun and the sand. Uh, we feel bad for you that you're not here, but. Okay, so back from the market, I'm just quickly show you what I got before I put everything away. So I got some veggie Jamaican patties, some pita bread. I got some gizada. Oh, Jesus. I'm ready. And some pudding, which I don't know about this. I don't know about that. But Okay, we'll do the try. Got some mushrooms. I got some veggie chunks. Okay. Zucchini, which have you ever seen a zucchini? Okay, this is what a zucchini is supposed to look like. Okay. Got some celery. Now the first time I ordered celery from here, I was like, what I wonder but when you look at it, the celeries are so cute and little bit. Look, have you ever seen a celery so cute and little bit like this? So good, and it smells so fresh. Okay, so I got that. I also got some beets. Some beets. And some bok choy, which you know, some of y'all might know it as pop chow. <laughs> Comment below. Comment below if uh, you know of a Jamaican that calls this pop chow <laughs> instead of the real name, bok choy. Anyway, so those are some of the stuff I got. As you saw, um, Jamila and I had some shawarma in town, but what I'm most excited about is the gazada. So I'm gonna try something gazada and let y'all know.